welcome back to Beauty with Bella. If you guys are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are not new, welcome back. Either way, I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch my channel. I am Bella and on this channel, I talk about beauty, mostly fragrances, y'all. And today I thought it would be fun to share with you guys fragrances from my collection that I have been really loving. So if you're interested in what I have to say, or you just want to spend time with moi, then keep on watching. Okay, by the way, y'all, if you haven't done so, please, please consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload videos. Let's make this small family grow, okay? Yes. Okay, fine. So the first one I have, y'all, is um, Bath and Body Works. Dahlia, Dahlia, I think I'm pronouncing that right. Y'all, this right here, I had this for months before I even picked it up to use it. I forgot I had it because I have so many fragrances. I brought it and my good Lord, when I finally used it, this is just, this is the bomb. It has uh, velvet Dahlia petals. I don't know what that smells like. It has crisp pear, praline, musk, and whipped tonka bean. Y'all, this smells like sweet, gourmand, sexy, deliciousness. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. It's kind of silky. This is like my favorite Bath & Body Works fragrance right now. Just putting it out there in the streets. This is, this is Bella's favorite one. I love how this smells. I love wearing it. Sometimes I layer it with other fragrances just because I just feel like it gives it that pop and it does. It's like, it's just one of those fragrances. I wish they had it in a perfume because I would definitely buy it because I wish it lasted longer. But man, this is just so good. When they have one of those sales, like buy three, get three free or buy three, get two three free, tongue tied. Get it. It smells good. Okay. That's enough about how much I love that one. Next one, y'all, is Chanel Chance Otandre. Y'all, you just, you can't get any better than this. This is like, oh, this is my favorite from the Chanel uh, Chance line. And I will link the notes up for you guys so you can see them. I'm not going to go into details too much with notes. I've talked about this before, but um, it's powdery. It's fresh. It has like some uh, grapefruit in it and it has some musk, I think. Y'all, this just smells good. When I wear this fragrance, it makes me feel so feminine and so classy. It's just one of those fragrances. And I know this bottle doesn't look like I've touched it, but this bottle is new. I had a smaller one that um, previously, and this is a bigger bottle that I got for Christmas. I'm just now opening it. So this one, y'all, oh my gosh, I love it. This is so great. And this can be purchased for under $100. This is the Eau de Toilette, by the way. You can get the smaller size for under $100, just FYI. Okay. The next one, y'all, oh, I brought this because of Abby with Love. This is my block signature. Oh, y'all, if I could wear this every day, I would wear it every day. The only reason why I don't wear it every day is because I have so many perfumes. That is how much I love this. Like, seriously. When I do a favorites, like best of 2021, you're gonna see this on here, like already. It's, this bottle can be a weapon, but oh my gosh, it, this smells so good. It has peony and a lang lang in it, and I think together, I also think this has vanilla. The sweetness of those two is like bomb.com. That combo is like the, it's that type of combo. This reminds me, I always say, it reminds me of a sweet, powdery, baby lotion, baby powder type of scent. It's it's just one of those. It is just like so good. On my skin, like I think after five hours or so, it becomes a skin scent, but I still get these whiffs all day of this gorgeous, gorgeous scent that I just love 
so much. I love it. Um, this is just a great scent and it can be purchased for under $100. I think it was like 57 bucks. So just the FYI. Okay, y'all, the next one that I have been reaching for and loving is uh, Juliana's Perfumes Inner Beauty. This is their version of Delina, and this smells so good. Like, it smells so good that it makes me want to get Delina, which I probably will eventually, because now I'm just curious. This, y'all, $59 on their website. I promise you, the longevity is all day. The sillage, the projection, this is like, I feel like I won a lottery for this being only $59. Um, I said this in one of my last videos when I talked about this fragrance. I sprayed this on a dress, hung the dress up in my closet, and every time I went in my closet, I kept saying, what smells so good in here? What smells so good? It was the dress. And this was like three days later, I could still smell it. My whole closet was smelling good. And I have like a nice size walk-in closet just from this. So if you cannot afford Delina right now, if that's just not in your budget, but you want to have something similar, go ahead and try this. It is just so good. Oh my gosh. Okay. Next one, y'all, I have been loving, and you can tell by the dent, is Alien Sublime. Y'all, this is like a, it's a citrusy, a slightly creamier version of Alien. And honestly, I feel like I like this one better than um, the original Alien. I said it. I said it. I still like the original Alien too, but this is just like, Oh my gosh, it has a whole bunch of notes in it, a bunch of citrusy notes. It has jasmine in it, of course. Um, it just, oof. You get that alien DNA plus the citrus notes, solar notes, vetiver, uh, some lemon. It just smells so good, y'all. And also, I got it for under $100. I am loving it this fragrance it is one of my favorites i love it i would actually wear this all year round to be honest it just smells so good okay the next one y'all this is one i slept on even after i purchased it i forgot about it and then when i finally wore it i was like whoa 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 and this is ysl's libre or libre the eau de parfum This is like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's, it's so good. Of course it has lavender in it. It has lavender at the top, it has lavender in the middle. It has orange blossom, which kind of gives it like a anomalic soapy type of vibe a little bit. Um, but it's not overpoweredly anomalic, if that makes sense. It's just just enough to get your attention. This is like, this fragrance for me is comforting. It's soothing. It's kind of um, sensual for me in a way. I just, I love this fragrance. And it's like, I slept on it. I've been hearing about this for a long time. I slept on it and I'm so glad I'm wide awake. I've, I'm woke. I'm, I'm seriously woke. I love this fragrance. And y'all, I said this before. This plus Bath and Body Works, Lavender and Vanilla, I'm done. Because this also has vanilla in it too. It's, it's over. It's just that combination right there, bang, bang. That's my combo for y'all. Those two right here, love it. Okay, y'all, the next one. We only got two more left. Next one, you guys, is um, this combo right here. MFK 540, the oil and the perfume. Y'all, you cannot tell me nothing when I wear this perfume, nothing. Cause I know, you don't have to tell me, even if you tried, 
Even if you tried it, I wouldn't listen because I know my nose is in the air when I wear this perfume. I'm that chick, I know it, I smell good. And I always look good when I wear it. I look good anyway, but it's just like, this is that perfume that just like elevates you. I feel rich when I wear it. I love it. I mean, it's an expensive perfume, so I should feel rich, but I have never worn this perfume and no one has said anything like, you smell good, what are you wearing? Through the mask, it's just that. Even with just the oil itself, I've still gotten compliments because I had the oil before I got the perfume as a Mother's Day gift. Thank you, children I gave birth to. Um, but even just wearing this, it's like so good. It's so good. And I know that there are so many fragrances out there that kind of have that vibe, but this is in a uh, class all by itself. It has saffron in it, and I, I think it has some jasmine in it and some fur resin. I'll, I'll put the notes up for you guys, some ambergris. This is just like... Get a sample. I got a sample from eBay before I bought it because this is something that's just so expensive for me um, to purchase just blind buy. But this, this is just one of those perfumes. You guys probably heard about it. You know about it. I love it. It's something that I reach for. I find reasons to wear it. I, j I just do. Okay, the last one, y'all. You probably heard about it. I've heard about it for a while. I don't know, I just never had an interest in buying it until I saw it was on sale at Macy's, the 3.4 fluid ounce plus the body lotion. I think with tax, I paid $72. It came with the stand. I couldn't pass it up. It was a blind buy, but I wanted to know, was this as good as I heard it was? It was. So this is Lancome's Edo. Y'all, my gosh, this is as good as they said. It's one of, I, I just got this, y'all. Maybe a month ago, do you see how much I've been wearing it? It has pear, it has rose in it. I put the, all the notes up for you guys. It's fresh, it's kind of aquatic, and that rose is not like, strong overpowering rose it's like a wet fresh rose i used to work in a floral shop way back in the day and when you first cut the rosings they're wet and stuff it smells really good that's what this smells like it's sparkly juicy pear oh i love this and i'm so glad i got the 3.4 fluid ounce now i want the intense version because um I really like this. Y'all don't sleep on like Macy's. If you're here in the States, look at the, their website, sign up for their emails because they have sales on perfume all the time where you can get sets for like crazy, insane prices. That's how I got a lot of my perfume doing like um, Black Friday sales. I've gotten Mon Guerlain and Wanted Girl for like $50 in like a set. So just look out for stuff like that. Okay, if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel, hitting the notification bell, and giving this video a thumbs up. Let's help the family grow. And comment down below, what fragrances have you been reaching for? Do you feel like it is overwhelming to have so many fragrances if you have a lot? Because sometimes it's like, why do you have this many perfumes? I actually love it, but sometimes I just gravitate towards certain things. So let's talk about it in the comments. And until we see each other again, guys, please stay safe. Remember you're blessed and you're beautiful. Blessed and beautiful, yes, 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 yes. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.